Hi guys, welcome to Sabondi Academy. In today's video, we'll be solving the question one of the 2020 June Wasi Commerce Theory questions. So we'll begin with question 1A. In a small town, 68% of the people own television, 72% owned radio, and 12% owned neither television nor radio. I represent the information on a Venn diagram. I, I, what percentage of the population own television only? So let's begin with the solution for our question one. Number of people who owned television is equal to 68%. So the number of people who owned radio is equal to 72%. The number of people who owned neither television nor radio is T union R complement is equal to 12%. And you know the total percent is 100%. And so our universal sets will be 100%. Now I represent the information on a Venn diagram. So we have our box representing the total number of people in the town. So our universal is equal to 100. The red circle represents the number of people who own television. And then the green represents the number of people who own radio. So N of radio is equal to 72. And N of television is equal to 68. So it says that 12% owned neither television nor radio. So we represent the number of people who owned neither television or radio here. And it's 12 now, we don't know the number of people who own television and radio, which is this portion of the diagram. So we represent it by X. So we have our X here. Now, the number of people who own television is 68. So this whole circle represents the number of people who own television. But then this part of it represents the number of people who own television and radio. So if you want to find the number of people who owned only television, we subtract the number of people who owned both television and radio from the total, which is 68. So the number of people who owned only television will be 68 minus X. And the number of people who owned only radio will be 72 minus X. So we are seeing that everything in the square should be equal to 100. So in that case, if you are finding x, you have 68 minus x plus x plus 72 minus x plus 12 is equal to 100. Now 68 plus 72 plus 12, we have 152. And negative x plus x is 0, then 0 minus x is minus x. And this is equal to 100. So when we make x the subject, you get negative x is equal to 100 minus 152. So our negative x will be equal to negative 52. Now when we divide here by negative 1, here by negative 1, the negative cancels negative. x over 1 is the same as x. And this is equal to negative cancels negative. So 52 over 1 is the same as 52. So the number of people who owned both television and radio is 52. But from our question, we are asked to find the percentage of the population who owned television only. So television only will be this part. Just this part. So the number of people who owned only television will be the whole of this portion. So if that's the case, then we can say that the number of people who owned only television is equal to 68 minus x. But we know that our x is 52. So we have 68 minus 52. And this is equal to 16. And we know that everything is in percentage, so we have 16%. So this gives us the number of people who owned only television. And this brings us to the end of question 1A. 
Now, don't forget to like and subscribe. And in case you have questions, don't forget to leave them in the comment section as well. So we'll be moving on to question 1B. Question 1B. We do and answer from the company and agree that their annual profits will be shared in the ratio 4 is to 5 respectively. If at the end of the year, Ansa received 5,000 more than Boidu, how much was Boidu's share? So let's begin with our solution. So they shared the profits in the ratio 4 is to 5. So the ratio is 4 is to 5. Now our total ratio will be equal to 4 plus 5, and that is 9. So we don't know the amount that was shared. So let the amount that was shared be x. So we can say that let profit shared be x. So in that case, Bwedu's share would be Bwedu's profit over the total profit times the amount that was shared. And Bwedu's ratio is 4. So we can say that Bwedu's share is equal to his ratio, which is 4, over the total ratio, which is 9 times the total amount shared, which is x. So we can say that answer share is 5 over the total, which is 9, times the amount that was shared, which is x. Answer share will be equal to 5 over 9x. But we are told that Ansa received 5,000 more than Buedu. So it means that if we should subtract Buedu share from Ansa share, we should get 5,000 Ghana CD. So, so Ansa share is 5 over 9x. Now when we subtract Buedu share from Ansa share, we should get 5,000. So minus 4 over 9x should be equal to 5,000. So now we multiply through by 9 to get rid of the fraction. So we have 9 times 5x over 9 minus 9 times 4x over 9 is equal to 5,000 times 9. So 9 cancels 9. We have 5x minus this cancels this. We have 4x is equal to 45,000. So when we subtract 4x from 5x, we have x, and this is equal to 45,000. But we know that the total amount or the total profit shared is in Ghana CDs. So then total profit shared will be equal to 45,000 Ghana CD. Okay, but from the question, we are being asked to find Boidu's share. So Boidu's share, which is 4 over 9 times x, will now be. So Boidu's share. is 4 over 9 x, but then our x is 45,000. So this is equal to 4 over 9 times 45,000. Now 9 goes here 1, it goes into 45, 5 times. So we have 5,000 here. Now 5,000 times 4, we have 20,000. So then, can say that Boidu's share is equal to 20,000 Ghana CD. 
So this brings us to the end of question one for the 2020 WASI core mass questions. So in our next video, we'll be doing the question two of the 2020 core mass theory questions.